Happy Sunday, everybody. Welcome back to a brand new video. It's been a long time since I did a Q&A one-on-one -on -one talk with you guys. And I am super excited to do a Q&A with you guys. Uh, let's answer some questions. And I'm wearing a hat because the hair is so blonde. It's not even close to gray. It's just like, whatever. I'm gonna probably just dye it back my, my normal color. It's unbelievable. Like, it's not even close to gray. I need to hit the gym, but I have no motivation. Any tips? Go to the fucking gym, bro! Like, what's the excuse? Why do you not have motivation? Ask yourself, why do you want to hit the gym? And then ask why you don't have any motivation. Because if you want to go to the gym because you want to change something about your body or feel more healthy, then that's your motivation. Pish? What's the weirdest comment you've gotten about your new haircut? That I'm one of the Backstreet Boys. Like, come on! Backstreet Back! When will the Nico workout be up and how long should, I bul should the bulk last? I will record the Nico workout quite soon and how long should your bulk last? It depends on where you're at and where you want to go. Usually people do like, they bulk for eight, nine months and then cut down for three months. Usually people bulk up, but I, when I started, I bulked up, like slowly bulked up like three, four years. So without getting really super, super lean, you know? What's your max pull up reps? I think I did this once and I think it was 19 or 20, like around that range. It's been a long time since I did that. That's like close to two years ago. I'm trying to lose my la last layer of fat while still gaining muscle. Mass gainer, a no go. Uh, there's a couple problems with this whole thing. The last layer of fat, which means you're already super low in body fat, which means you have to be very low in calories to achieve to lose more body fat, which means the muscle gain is probably zero. I would focus on one of the two and not try to do them together. And the mass gainer, I would only take a mass gainer if you are uh, bulking or if you have trouble bulking because a uh, mass gainer is usually very high in calories and if you are cutting, taking a lot of calories at the same time can, you know, can suck a little bit because I, what I like to do is spread my calories throughout the day so I don't feel super, super hungry at a certain time. How do you feel about ketocinetics? Uh, sick. I want to try it. My man Stan Brownie, we need to collab soon. Uh, I'll text you right after we record this video because we need to set up this video. How can I grow muscle mass as a teenager? Lift weights, eat well, eat your proteins. Will face fitness ever return? Find out next time on Face Jasper. Um, it might. Uh, it's all about to say. Maybe. <laughs> maybe soon, maybe not soon. I don't know. I do know, but I, I don't know. <laughs> what made you want to start YouTube videos? That's a great... I started um, making gaming videos because I like playing games and I like recording and playing with friends and having a good time. Uh, after that, I started doing the fitness videos because when I was starting fitness and I was making some progress, a lot of my friends were telling me like, or were asking me like, hey, how do you do this? Like, how's your routine looking? Whatever, whatever. And honestly, I love helping people like in every aspect of like, like when it comes to fitness or anything else where I can help my friends, uh, I want to help. I try to help where I can. Like I, I, was, I will always be there for friends and people that I love, family, girlfriend. Like I will always be there for people. So um, that's really why I started making fitness YouTube videos because I feel like sharing my story can maybe help some other people. Do you think I can make it into Face Clan as a 17 year old grinder? Yes, of course, everybody can. I'm not even that sick and I'm in face, you know, by just working for it. Is it possible to cut to eat 60% clean or 40 and 40% 40 bad foods? Yes, it is possible. Um, it's about calories in versus out, so pretty much you can do it. Uh, it's probably not the most optimal way to do it, but yeah, it's the, you can do it. Technically speaking, you can do it. Best way to lose weight as a teenager. Check what you're eating, your daily habits. Check how many calories you are eating. Check your diet, check your daily diet. Check your what you're eating at school, check what your mom's cooking. If it's too much, you know, cut down on the calories. What are your goals for 2019? Uh, face fitness related goals. So I've been working behind the scenes and it's taken a long time, but I've been working on my own hoodies. This is the first time I've ever said that. Oh my God, please, I just, it's out there. Um, yes, I am putting, I want to do, make my own hoodies and I'm currently working on that. So uh, that's something for 2019, that's definitely my goal. Also, face fitness is definitely something that's in the works right now, but I don't know actually. <laughs> this is a great question. If you could reverse time, Back to when you started training, what would you change? About my training, I don't think so much. Maybe I would switch to push-pull legs earlier, um, but I would change more about my diet and try to eat more from the beginning. That's what I would try. What is the best exercise for triceps? 
probably something like a um, skull crusher or a close grip bench press, something like that. It's like a very big compound exercise which you could, maybe a weighted dip also, uh, something that you could use a lot of weight on uh, that will make your tricep grow. I can't eat my macros with healthy foods only. It's too much for me, what can I do? It's okay to have some bad foods in your macros to hit it in my opinion. You can only eat so much rice, right? It, like, it's, it's, if you want to bulk up and you need to eat like 3,500 3, calories, yes, it's definitely possible, but maybe not for you because you're in school, you can't cook everything, like whatever, whatever. It's okay to have 20 or 30% bad foods in your diet to hit your macros, in my opinion. Is it fun to work together with TFU and other phase members? Bro, it's the best. All these guys in phase are super hardworking, super humble, super nice guys and I like to be around those people. They are hardworking, grinding towards something and want to be something and want to make something of their life. You know, uh, winners win. Will you guide my nutrition? Yeah, if you go to my website, it's gonna be in the description and uh, for online coaching, I can help you with your diet. So yeah, check the link in the description. All right, last question is probably the most asked question. How did you get into phase? How in the hell are you in phase? I don't know, bro. Um, so how I got into phase, pretty much, I was in Amsterdam in film school for a year, started working out a lot, liked it, was always a phase fan before that, um, had an idea, what if phase does something with fitness to promote a healthy lifestyle um, for their fan base, for the gamers, because obviously the, the stereotype gamer is a fat kid sitting in his basement playing all day long, right? So. Um, so that's my idea, right? I was a gamer, I was in shape, and I wanted to spread that idea of working out as a gamer. So I emailed them a couple times, like probably like 40 to 50 times, perseverance. And then the 50th time, I got a, I got a tweet from Face Temper that says, hey, we are already working on that idea, uh, blah, blah, blah. So I was like, oh God, God damn it. So then Face Sensei, made a video on his channel saying, hey, I want to coach five people of the face community uh, to help them get in shape. So I was like, all right, I'll just send him an email and say like, hey, I don't need help, but uh, I can help you with face fitness because he was the one that's gonna start it initially. So he got back to me, he's like, okay, sure. Yeah, send me a video, whatever. We can talk on Skype. We were in this Skype chat with all the other fans that he was going to, going to help. We had a call and then I started helping those kids. Like, hey, you can do this and this and this and this and this and this. And Sensei was like, okay, cool. This guy can help others and um, knows what he's doing. And I like it. So he's like, okay, maybe I can, I can use some help with face fitness because I'm not really too familiar with YouTube and how to run all that. So I was like, yeah, I can help you with face fitness. And that's how I kind of rolled into face. And then I never got the, hey, you phrase Jasper now until Face Fitness got put on the roster, the official roster back in the day, and it says Face Jasper. I was like, wait a minute, I am in Face now. So that's pretty much how I rolled into it, by perseverance, working for it, and um, you know, just grabbing the opportunity by the balls, and um, take, I mean, and taking the opportunity by the balls, and kind of like going with it, and working really, 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 really hard. That's how I got into FaZe. So, you, it's, it's definitely possible to join FaZe Clan. It's not, doesn't have to be through gaming only. Maybe you have an idea like me that you think is suitable for FaZe and who knows what the future has in store for you. All right? So uh, take that, take my story as your inspiration, as motivation, that if you want something, you can go for it and it can work out. All right? Talk to you guys later. I'm not sure what this is, but uh, I'll talk to you guys later. Deuces and face up all mother freaking
to laugh at me.